Alright, YouTube, Mike LS again. Um, so I'm just giving y'all a quick update on the Tesla screen. So um just got installed as I can see it's real dope. Um, it's a dope view. I gotta play with it some more, get used to the screen, the settings and all that. Um and the connections. Um so so far I've been trying to like connect my phone to the screen and it's like I don't know it was like a little delay or something so I don't know as I said I gotta play around with the setting some more um, basically um, also go back on YouTube and they have a full um, you know video about you know settings and different things you could do with it because it's basically this is like an Android and um, it's like a computer like an onboard computer in your car so um, it's different, it's cool. I love the size of the screen, 13.6. Um, I connected my personal hotspot to it, the, um, the Wi-Fi. Um, I went on YouTube um, a little bit just to see, you know, how it reacts and how it do. So, um, so far, so good. Um, it was a little lagging, I guess, because of where I was at and all that. But I gotta actually revisit, it. revisit you know what I mean, where I put the, um, the UBS. He has buyers, which I have to put that in the fifth place. So it's just like kind of like a, a trial thing I'm just doing right now to, um, you know, just to see what it is. So I'm definitely gonna um, play around with it. But um, yeah, this is it's pretty dope. It's pretty dope. I'm excited about it because I didn't have a radio for a while, so I already was holding back and waiting to do this, which is done. Um, the installation is a little bit like in terms of as I said before. Um, really got to look at the YouTube video when they um kind of kind of break down like they break down basically you know what I mean how to plug everything up what's needed depending on the kind of um setup you got in your vehicle your escalate in terms of you got the um entertainment center in the back which I don't stuff that you don't have to plug in and eliminate but um they give you the options of having the RCA wise and all that just in case you will add an entertainment system in the back and all that so um it's it's pretty good um the sounds sound great in this truck it sounds real good so um I'm satisfied with that but as I said I gotta um just revisit um wire placements and all that and which I'm gonna do and um yeah it's, I mean it's pretty dope when you got this big um screen for the navigation so like if you're traveling and as i say if y'all um if y'all new to my channel once again subscribe to the channel like for my lesson um, hit that like button um hit that notification um also um yeah back to what i was saying so this um truck is really intent to tow so something a screen like this is really needed so you know i could you know see my map play my music if i want to go on youtube or whatever it may be like you no, know, or just search something like also because as I said, it's a it's a onboard computer Android setup, and um yeah, so this is what it looked like um as I said, this is my trial my trial of using this right now, and um as I said, I'm gonna look at more videos and I'm gonna play with the settings and all that till I get to my right settings where I'm comfortable using it and having it and that's what it is so um as i said so far so good man so far so good i mean it's 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 dope right the only thing is like i'm gonna go to home button and i got i guess it's i see this vehicle here which i gotta actually see how i could change that because i don't know what vehicle is this um recently you got your rpm and your mileage which basically you can see it kind of like um interface with what we have here and it got a lot of different features and as i said i got the option the one with the ac control um so everything is basically touch screen which is pretty dope um and it's pretty good man um, i like it so far so far i like it but you know um i'm gonna play with it and i'm gonna give an overall review on you know how it functions and, and and what i think about it you know what i mean because that's what it is with um a lot of products it's like you gotta play with it you gotta learn it and then you give your overall review of what you think of it and that's basically what i'm gonna do so i just wanted to give you a quick update on the screen and as i said i gotta get that truck 
whatever truck is out here and see if I can put the home. Um, they have it where well, you can put the escalator on it, but I just don't know. I thought it when I came already pre-uploaded once I uploaded it because, you know, I did tell them the option. I did tell them the year of the vehicle, whatever, so I thought that would have just, like, really just popped up, but I don't know what pop, what the hell is that. So, we gonna see if we can um, correct, correct that vehicle. Yeah, so you see, as, as if y'all really paying attention, I'm looking for mileage in the RPMs. Um, basically, um, it's insane. Um, I was playing around with it and I seen the um, the tire pressure, the tire pressure on the vehicle, which they have an um, option where you can actually see that on the screen. But, um, I also can see it on my, on my onboard dash also. I can see my tire pressure, so um, yeah. This is what the Texas screen look like, man. So, um, welcome, people. Welcome, welcome, man. We progress. We 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 get in motion. Um, we checking this off on the list. And now, are y'all ready for the tow? Because I think I'm ready for the tow. You know what I mean? I'm just waiting for a few more accessories. Um, I might order some straps. You know what I mean for the tow. And I got the um the hitch adapter with the um the ball. So um. Yeah, I'm ready for the tow. I'm ready for the tow. You know what I mean, as I said, just a little minor stuff. I just want to um, clean up with this, learn this, and then we ready, man. We go do the first tow on Renzel, tow on the GTA box Chevy. You know what I mean? See how that work out, how the vehicle behave, and all that. And that's what we doing. So once again, as I said, man, if you're new to the channel, my name is Life with Mike L S. If you haven't subscribed, it costs nothing to subscribe to my channel, people. Real talk. So, all right, as I said, man, I just want to give y'all a quick dope update of the Tessie screen. You know what I mean? If you're interested in getting one or you're, you know, you're looking into it, you know what I mean? So, um, yeah, this is what it is. All right, so once again, man, I'm out. You know what I mean? Catch y'all on the next video.